Hello everyone, I'm Deb Courtney and welcome to my YouTube channel. So glad you're here today. I'm finishing up the Real You in the Future um, videos. I'm still on the Lifestyle Matters series and I will still continue that next week even though I'm, it'll be a different topic. But I have four, four points that are left that I want to discuss with you in regards to the Real You in the Future. So let's begin. The seventh one was, is... When you announce the real you in the future, it will agitate, intimidate, infuriate others. Go ahead and expect it, but let it go. There is just some people that, for whatever reasons, they don't like to see people succeed. Um, and, it, hey, it could be a member of your family. It just, it, people are people. And so they have different personalities. A lot of people um, live with a negative personality and they just, nothing works for them. And that's, hey, if it works for them, it works for me. But I am talking about the real you in the future and the desires that you want to uh, see take place uh, to manifest places you want to go, do things that you want to do, things that you want to have. You will have people that may not be so much on board with you in regards to it. And go ahead and expect it. Don't let it be intimidating or a, a surprise uh, because. It, it just is what it is. Sometimes that's life with people, and but just let it go. That's okay. That's it. That's, that's, that's all you can do, really. You stay focused on what you want to have take place in your real you in the future. Okay, number eight. Here we go. Every appointment you make should be taken with the real you in the future in mind. Stop wasting your time and unclutter your life and time. Everything that you can do that has to do with that real you in the future, then work on it. Now, there are, you will, I mean, you know, you got to have time for rest, sleep family, yourself, and so forth and so on. But there are ways that you, a lot of times, you, you hear you hear this all over uh, social media about how people uh, will take and list out six things they're going to do each and every day or three things or five, whatever number works for them. And then they start with the most important, then they go down, down, down. And the, so they start with the one and they work on that. When they get through with that and that is taken care of, then they'll go to the next one and, and, and so forth. So they have what they have actually done is they have made an appointment schedule in regards to working on what they want the real them to be in the future. And so... You have to do the same thing. I have to do the same thing. Okay, the ninth point is the real you in the future will change your relationships. Hey, relationships shift and change. That's all during life. As you grow and go through life, you, there's, hey, graduating from high school, I, there's a lot of people I don't I've never seen anymore since I since graduation. Uh, people that that you have in college, you may or may not ever see those folks again. Relation relationships change, relationships shift, um, and you just have to be you just you just have to be ready for that and understand that it's all a part of you becoming who you desire yourself to be, become, do, or have in the future. Um, that, that's, that's not to say that there's something, it's not bad or wrong. Not at all. Uh, people go on and live their life. Uh, and the last point is this. 
The real you in the future is birthed through your measure of faith. Let me tell you something. Greatness is all around you. So read books about extraordinary achievers. Have conversations with people whom you admire and look up to, who you think that will give you sound coaching, sound advice, sound clarity. You know who they are. People who inspire you to be you in the future. Hang out with them as much as you can. If you can't, then find out as much about them as you can. And do that. So, the best real you in the future can take place. It can happen. And you can make it happen. So, I hope you enjoyed these three videos in regards to the real you in the future. It's really helped me to do what I do, what I want myself to look like, to have, do, and become in the future. And I just think it's an awesome and great thing. I hope you gleaned some kind of information from these three videos and that you can use them in your future. I'm Like I said, this is not all of it, but anyways, glad you're here. Go out and make it a great day, and I'll see you again next week with a new topic.